香港占领运动十二月十号进入第七十四日，香港警方计划星期四对金钟占领区展开全面清场。喺警察行动前夕，香港官员星期三继续呼吁示威者自行撤离，好多抗议者亦表示唔会同警察对抗。好多示威者已經開始執拾，準備離開佔領區。預計警方星期四上晝將會出動上千警力，強制清理金鐘佔領區。呢度亦係香港佔領運動嘅起點。喺呢度，抗議者漏夜製作咗勢必歸來嘅標語。多名示威者話：佢哋星期四唔會挑戰公權力。一名參與佔領運動一個月嘅學生話 ：，News that some students will be violent and fight with the police, but I think I won't fight with them because it's not. Uh, take advantage for us. We, we don't have any weapon, and they got the weapon and we were hurt. So I don't think I will. I will leave. I just and wait another movement again and come out and spread this、uh, message to the society. 另外一名示威者準備喺星期四警方清場嘅時候協助醫療工作，希望自己可以做到一啲誒幫下手去誒。Uh, 啊！急救啊，或者係啊，幫啲受咗傷嘅朋友嘅角色啦。咁啊，啊，會聽日會預咗啊，警察會嚟到。我自己希望聽日唔好太多人有事啦。咁啊，能夠留到多一秒就多一秒咯。香港官員星期三再度呼籲抗議者主動撤離。Understandably, despite all the appeals from various quarters, I suspect there will still be protesters who prefer to stay in the protest site tomorrow. So I will appeal to them that they should abide by what they have said all along, and that is to adopt a peaceful, orderly, and non-violent approach, with a view to avoid unnecessary confrontation with the police. 香港学联喺星期三话，部分学联成员会留守到最前方，本住和平理性非暴力原则，抵御警方清场。佢哋并且呼吁留守者唔好攻击同埋投掷物品，避免引发警方暴力升级。香港警察喺星期二举行记者会，表示星期四可能驱散或者拘捕拒绝离开嘅人，并且唔会俾抗议者太多执拾物品嘅时间。佢话警方将会使用同抗议者抵抗水平相称嘅武力。We will not tolerate any violent acts. Any acts charging, such as charging the police cordon line, etc., and we will take resolute actions against anyone, like the radicals or troublemakers, while we are executing our duty. 香港警方又呼吁民众星期四避免前往警察清场嘅区域。喺香港占领行动的将落幕之前，民众亦回顾咗今次运动嘅成果。一名三十六岁嘅抗议者话。Although we did not win what we won ultimately, but、uh, we have learned from the movement, and that we can definitely do better next time, perhaps in the future. 另外一名二十一岁嘅抗议者话：，诶，只系政府一路话知道你嘅诉求，但系佢冇回应过，真真正正回应过，即系对话又冇啦，诶，俾到啲嘢系冇啦，所以我觉得呢两个月嚟，即系话只可以话，诶，我哋。堅守喺度兩個月，係講到我哋想要嘅嘢，但係得到嘅成果係仲未有。香港警方星期四上晝九點開始將協助執行高等法院針對金鐘部分佔領區嘅臨時禁制令，一並清理禁制令範圍外嘅障礙物，進行全面清場。警方將部署最多可達七千警力，而政府各個部門亦部署啟動後備辦公室同應急措施，盡量避免公務員到政府總部上班。美國之音電視報道。